Well, welcome back everyone. Okay, so pretty excited. Got the first real print off the printer. So this is actually the enclosure, or the bottom of the enclosure anyway, for the Big Tree Tech SKR 1.3 controller board. So I can get that tidied up somewhat. Now, it wasn't without some issues. <laughs> One version, two versions. Let's see if we can get a close up. You can see there's been a shift in XY. Three versions, another shift in XY. Another version uh, started to uh, shift in XY. Uh, I only printed this at 0.4 and I'm not really looking for a super fine finish I'm just looking for something practical and I want to get it done as soon as possible so I just whacked it in at 0.4 layer height and printed it and actually it's come out really good now all this crap here in the end um, after lots of stuffing around wondering what the issue may be I put a little cooling fan on the actual drivers it's literally just sitting on top of the driver heat sinks at the moment and plugged into the bench power supply and that resolved all of the layer shift issues so obviously the drivers were just getting up to their temperature and shutting down and essentially just missing steps and it, strangely enough, it sort of shifted in the diagonal. Actually, it does move in the diagonal with one drive stopped and the other one moving. So I think just one driver shut down. I've got a bit of footage of the print. It's probably the start of one of the ones that was working initially. <laughs> so I'll post that at the end of this. But yeah, at the end of the day, Really, really happy. Um. So, just when you thought it couldn't get any worse, um, I'll show you what. <laughs> what I've got going here now okay so in here is a Raspberry Pi uh, with camera and that's running a Repetier Server Pro and there it is there so that's what's controlling the actual print so one more thing thrown into the mix. This is the enclosure that I used to use with the, uh, uh, there is a lid for the TARDIS. That's the enclosure I used to use on the Delta. Uh, it was just standalone. Sit it beside the Delta so the webcam could see what was going on. But I'll do an enclosure for the actual uh, printer eventually so that it's uh, permanently mounted as well. So, Raspberry Pi connected by USB to the uh, Big Tree Tech board. So nothing's changed here. This is still a mess. Uh, all the wiring's held together with strings and mirrors. And I slapped some caps on tape down really quick. You can see there's bubbles everywhere. Pretty crap job. But I, I, I've never had much joy printing straight onto aluminium, I've got to say. So I have had no problems at all under kept on tape, even when it's put on as crappy as this, you know. It just seems to stick. A few places here where the support material has come adrift. In fact, it did on the back here as well. But it uh, seems to have resorted itself out somehow. So there you go. There's a little wing. 
So this is the actual enclosure I'm printing for the um, board. I've moved on to PTG, the same as I used for all of the bits on the printer. Still no cooling fan as you'll note, but in all honesty, I think on PETG I pretty much only use around 15-20% cooling after the first few layers anyway, and I get a little bit of stringing, not much, but um, I've found on the Delta anyway that seemed to work perfectly okay for me, and you know on here without a cooling fan it seems to be working uh, pretty well. I haven't done too many adjustments on here yet. I still haven't looked at the belt tension. I think it, I do think it does need to be a little bit tighter, but hey, it's it's printing now anyway, so I'm just going to run with where it is at the moment until I've got a lot of this wiring sorted out and it'll be a bit easier to, you know, make adjustments around the place. Yeah, so anyway, there's a a little bit of an update.
If you like what I'm doing, then please do like the video. If you'd like to see more, then please subscribe. And don't forget to hit the chime so you get notified when I post something new. And I'll put a couple of links here to some other videos you can look at.